Hey everyone, Blake Smith, Realtor here in Plainfield in a subdivision called The Ponds. Very desirable subdivision, doesn't always come up. As you can see behind me, it's a beautiful looking house. So let's check it out. I'll tell you what, you can see over here, we're having an open house. You can see my sign, undeveloped property off to the side over there, undeveloped property behind us. There's a story behind that. Stay tuned with me. As we go through, we're gonna go through the interior, beautiful finished basement, and when we're all done, I'm gonna explain that backyard and what's going on and why it's gonna be that way for a long time. Let's go and check it out now. All right guys, thanks for staying tuned. Let's do a walkthrough on the interior. As you can see, you walk in and just an amazing, flowing large entryway. You know, look off to your left. off to your left and you have a formal dining room or living room area walks right into the formal dining room walk off to your right you've got an awesome den an opportunity to potentially even put in a couple of french doors here make it a very private office but right now it's a fantastic office and den the way it is you've got your coat closets and things over here the really nice basement that we'll get to fully finished in a minute be really nice calf bath to our right, beautiful stonework. As you can see, this is like really nice stone tile throughout the kitchen. Again, here's a nice pantry. Living room, and again, fantastic views on this house. Stick through with us, so we're gonna have an idea of the backyard. I promise if you stay to the end of this video, the backyard is worth it. The next section of this house, the basement, is definitely worth it and you're gonna enjoy it. So, so excited. Again, coming from the inside to the out, here's a nice laundry, first floor laundry. Just very nice. Three car garage, which you guys could see from the outside. And that backyard, a little bit of ticker, that's coming soon, stick around and see that. All right, so let's go upstairs, look at the bedrooms and the bathrooms. And then from there, we will take a quick tour of the basement, finished. And then lastly, stick around for that backyard. All right, everyone, stay, thanks for sticking around. We're gonna do the upstairs. You can see here's a look from midway up the platform on our way up the stairs and head upstairs. Directly ahead is a really nice linen closet right there. Probably the smallest bedroom, but these views. Wait till you get to the backyard and see what I'm talking about. This bedroom's nice, really good sized closets. Just wrapping up an open house, so there's still a ton of people sitting outside the front. Full bath here in the middle. More linen closets. Huge walk-in, like huge owner suite. Huge walk-in closets. Again, another entire full bath. That back here is coming. All right, so let's go check out the basement. The basement, guys, is fantastic. It's got, it's fully finished and you'll see. And again, stay tuned. We're gonna get to that backyard as well. Here's a little bit of a different look for the entryway. All right, I told you, guys, this basement's worth waiting for. You're really gonna enjoy this. This is fully finished basement. You know, again, more space down here. You can have a really nice office area. Storage under the stairs here behind this door. I don't want to get it off of the really boring stuff, but here's your utility closet. Good size. Check out this storage. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Storage, storage, storage. Huge. Like this room is so deep and so long the video does not do it justice at all. So much space here, guys. This could be a theater room, could be a workout room, could continue to be storage. Over here, we have another area. So back where we came from is that way. Huge area there for office space or just whatever workout area. Here's a nice place the way they have it set up right now. TV, relaxing family area. Closet with a sump. Nice 
bright down here even without the lights because of these good sized window wells. Right here, it looks like they have another little TV set up. It's kind of a workout area. This could be another office space. It could even be, honestly, a spare area if someone were to come to visit as far as a bedroom. Could even potentially become a bedroom. And again, here's the other half bath. So again, guys, this house has two full bathrooms upstairs, a half bath, and then a half bath that down here in the basement. Like I said, fully finished, really nice. Thanks for sticking with me on that. Get ready to see this backyard. Talk to you soon. All right, hello everyone. Hopefully you're hearing me okay. I had to switch out my mic. Um, wind picks up in this backyard and what I was using was definitely picking up the wind. So hopefully this is a much better solution. Hopefully you can hear it well. Let me know in comments if it seems okay. But anyway, I told you the backyard was worth waiting for. The entire thing is fenced in. There is a, a spot here where they had an out of ground pool that they take in and out for the spring and fall. There are really nice landscaping over here, as you can see. We'll go and check that out a little bit closer. There are planter boxes back here. Um, the landscaping is just awesome. You can tell we're just getting to be spring here in Chicagoland, so we've got some time there coming. The gazebo here could be negotiated as to stay or go. Depends on the buyer and what they need. Oh, I just almost stepped on a little tiny frog. Anyway, <laughs> so, Here's a bunch of uh, the landscaping. Here's those boxes and guys, here it is. So here's the story that I told you to stick around for at the beginning. This land is supposed to stay undeveloped for the next 20 years minimum. Um, we've got an owner that is currently, again, owns this property that this property does back up to. I see a lot of the neighbors using it, enjoying it. Got some little four wheel trains and things back there. But um, there's a gate from here going out. You can see this entire lot is completely fenced in. Great for pets, whatever you guys want to use it for. And again, so relaxing over here. But so the story, the story is they're planting corn one year, soybean the next, doing the old government tax situation in that they are keeping this land the way it is again. The plan is for at least 20 years. So you move in here, you don't have any new neighborhoods, no, no new neighbors or construction behind you. If you're looking for that, give us a call. We'd love to show you this thing privately. Phone number 630-460-7845. And again, Blake Smith, at this point, I think that's all we had for this thing. So thank you for sticking around. Thank you for, I told you this backyard was worth it. So check off, um, you know, please share this, like this. We appreciate your we appreciate your time your uh, continued support of our channels. So have a great day. Talk to you soon.